Hey Umbrella Agents, hey welcome to Resident Evil Umbrella Core. So it turns out in order to get online and the experiment mode, you just have to wait a little bit. You have to wait for the game to download, then all this stuff. Then like online experiment, you know, will unlock. But you know, I also customized my character, I also customized his looks, his guns and all that. So I'll show you guys, you know, all that when when we're doing the experiment. The experiment is just like I said, it's basically a, you know, it's kind of not really a story mode, but kinda of like a like survival kind of mode. So I'm gonna show you guys, you know, the first one called Deadly Experiment. Abraham Jackson, the day is finally upon us. We're resuming the experiments. Sure took their sweet time. But enough about that. We will start with the abandoned umbrella research facility. You'll find plenty of researchers there. Or what's left of them. <laughs> umbrella lab. Wait what? I wait, can I, wait what? I can't pick my customize I I can't pick my customizable guy? Wait what? Why? I, 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 it's been like two, it's been like 15 minutes, but like two hours customizing my, the perfect umbrella agent. And now you're not telling me I can't use it? Like, what the fuck? That's like, that's like, a, I really wish that I could use my, um, customizable character in this deadly experiment. Do dun 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 What experiment are they talking about? The tyrant's nemesis. Oh man, I'm not, it's not my own. Oh, it's not my cool looking guy. Ready, begin. Watch that. Huh? It's a zombie. Huh? I look like a zombie. Back up! You dead? Huh? Yeah, Green herb. Uh. Back up! Yeah! I'm an umbrella agent, dammit! Yeah! Uh. Okay, go, go, go. There yeah, is. there it is. Reload. Shit! Ah, what the fuck? Ah! Uh. Uh. Wow, wow, this is fuck this one's mine. Uh, shit, we got zombies! Zombies inbound! I don't think this one, this one's a crawler, we got a crawler! Okay, run through that. Alright. Fuck! Oh fuck, they're everywhere! Shit. Uh, got these two! Yeah, 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 yeah! Give me this. Yeah, out of the way! Give me a green herb. Uh, can you, where's the zombie shield? I'll use the zombie shield. Back up. Oh! Woo! There it is. I'm, getting the, I'm getting the headshots. Okay. What the fuck? Change the pick a weapon. Samurai Edge? Oh fuck! <gasps> what the fuck? Yeah. Out of the way, zombie. Shit! More zombies! God. Shit! More zombies! Fuck! Zombie shield! Yeah! 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 Damn it! Two. Damn it! There's a lot of them. Don't worry. Nothing I can't handle. It's not my hand. You survived. Well, I'm an umbrella agent, damn it! Of course I'll survive. Experiment completed. Of course, I'm an umbrella agent, damn it! Why wouldn't I survive? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last kill. Oh, that it really? Really? Okay. Well, you know, what? I, I think I have time to show you guys some of the customizations, and I want to show you. I don't know. No, I want to show you guys my cool looking umbrella agent. What? Oh. Wow. Okay. You know, before I do that, I want to show you guys. You know, my cool. You know, my cool looking badass dude. I call him Bob. You, how about this? You you pick his name. You know, I'm gonna let you guys pick my umbrella agent name. Th there he is. There he is. Look how badass he is. Look at my outfit. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh man. Wait, wait, what do you think about the chrome, huh? What do you think of the chrome? You know, I'm not really liking the whole back the shell jammer chrome look. But you know, let me change it right now. Um What color should I have that though? No, let's make it like let's make it bright yellow. Yeah, let's make it bright yellow so people can so people can, like, can actually see you know, like the whole Grim Reaper thing I have in the back. So yeah, so what do you guys think of my character? You know, what, what what's your thoughts? What's your opinions? Uh, I really want, leave it in the comment section. What do you guys think about you know my ultimate umbrella agent? And what do you guys think the ultimate umbrella agent should look like? I really I really want to know. leave it in the comment section. What do you believe the ultimate umbrella agent should look like? Other than Hunk? I mean, come on, we all know Hunk is like you know the ultimate ultimate umbrella agent. So basically, I got all these patches. From, when you pre-order the game, you get all of these patches. Even though that I only use like what, like four, <laughs> it's only equipped to like four patches. But there's this one pack, there's like a few patches in particular, where I really, you know, that like I, I they're a great throwback to Resident Evil, you know, lore. Um, I think it's yeah, here it's in the details. Right here is a great throwback to some of the Resident Evil games, such as. Right here, of course, the Brother Core, but see this the BSAA is basically 
you know, the agency where Chris and Leon, um, Chris, Jill, Leon, and all that, you know, work at. Basically, they're the ones who's basically monitoring the world for B.O.W.s, which, and this, which is like the main premise of like Resident Evil 6. And this is the BSA, the, the West African branch of the BSAA, which is Resident Evil 5. This is where Chris meets she Sheva, and they both, you know, try to stop the Ouroboros and take down Wesker in Resident Evil 5. This is the, the BSAA 1, which I think is from Mercenaries. I think, I think it's either from Mercenaries or from Resident Evil Revelations. These two, I think these two are either from Revelations or, you know, Mercenaries. While the RPD is from Resident Evil 1, the classic Resident Evil, like the very classic Resident Evil. So class Resident Evil 1, 2, and 3. Those are like the classic, classic Resident Evil. So RPD, I basically stand for uh, Rac Rac Raccoon City Police Department. But, I, but within the RPD, there's a branch called STARS, which is a Special Tactics and Rescue squ Unit, or Squad, whatever you want to call it. The... It's called the special, yeah, I think it's called the special tactics and rescue squad. That's basically where the first time you ever meet Chris, Jill, Rebecca, but that's the first time you meet them. RPD is more associated with Leon S. Kennedy, while Star is more associated with Jill and Chris and all that. Now these two, the US, the USB, the UBC, the, the UBCS, the USFS, and the Spec Ops, I think those three are from Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City. Which wasn't really a bad game per se, but I think it's kind of like, it kind of like had the same lore of Umbrella Core, where it didn't really stick to the, like, the classic Resident Evil like horror, where it kind of had like a little, a little bit between like a mix of horror and action, but mainly like online mostly. The, the Salzar Family Crest and Veltro, which I think Veltro is definitely Resident Evil Revelation. I think that was the terrorist group that, you know, took over the, the, the boat shit, I think. I mean, it has been a long time since I played Resident Evil, uh, Revelations, and I think that fell through. The Salazar Family Crest, that is very familiar to me, but I'm not 100% sure which Resident Evil game that is. If you know it, please leave it in the comment section. But if, yeah, leave it in the comment section. If you know what the Salazar Family Crest, what game, what Resident Evil that's from. Uh, Umbrella and Tricell. Which I think is actually from the Resident Evil movie, not the live action one, the animated one. Re Resident Evil Degration, I think it's called. D um, I think that's from not the live action or no, Resident Evil movies. So those are a whole different lore. I think this is from the actual, you know, um, animated one. Yeah, see, RPD officer Made in Heaven. I think Made in Heaven was the insignia or like the thing that Claire had on her back. That the uh, Claire had on her jacket. I think that was the thing that Claire had on her jacket. The Los Illuminados. That's that was the signal from Resident Evil Four. Uh, Shiva's tattoo. I never know Shiva had a tattoo. I never really looked at Shiva well because I can't. I hate Shiva. I mean, we all. I mean, if you play Resident Evil Five, you'll hate Shiva too. And I, I never really paid a close attention to her. I ne never know she had a tattoo. Let me live. I'm not sure what's what callback to Resident Evil that is. I'm not sure, but if you do know, please leave in the comment section. So when we come back, I'll be showing you guys some multiplayer matches where I'll most likely get my ass handed to me because I am not so good at multiplayer. So, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And from my umbrella agent to everyone out there, from my umbrella agent to you, have a marvelous day and just, you know, full of smiles and happiness and love and smiles, guys. Peace out, everyone. Have a marvelous, spectacular day. Where? I probably just don't know how to climb walls, remember? You know how to do evil stuff on climb walls? Oh, uh, oh, no, I thought, oh, no, I was maybe up here. No, no, what the, okay. Oh, oh, wait, what?